Hello my friends, I hope you all are doing great. This is me again, Johnny M, recording this time from Belgium. And uh, it was such a long day, so exhaustful and I'll be honest with you, I'm so glad that I'm here with you recording this episode, it's such a relief. And I'm also glad because this hotel where I'm, t- I'm uh, today apparently has fiber, so I'll be able to upload this episode in a timely fashion. But back to our uh, business. Uh, you probably guessed it, we're playing Farming Simulator 17 on Canadian map Ultimate. And in the previous episode we harvested We basically had our first harvest of barley, which uh, I needed for straw for our animals. This episode... Oh, and also we uh, mowed this uh, field of grass that we seeded previously. And this episode we are going to uh, bale the grass uh, that we just mowed. Of course not... uh, uh, before it is uh, rode by uh, one of uh, of uh, helpers. I have to tell you that this is probably third attempt at uh, bailing this field, because I was testing uh, different uh, bailers mods, and believe it or not, as I mentioned previously, most of them are. Uh, I don't want to use a bad word, but uh, let's put it like this: uh, they're subpar. So I had to uh, restart recording this episode a couple of times. And ultimately I uh, had no other option than to use this uh, in-game baler, which is actually a great one, because it also uh, wraps up uh, the bales. And yes, I probably haven't invested enough time to download more balers. I downloaded, I don't know, two or three of them and they all sucked. Uh, probably in the future I'll find something better, but for now we're gonna use this one. And I don't know, probably there is a possibility to disable the bale wrapping on this baler, but I don't know of it. So um, uh, I'll have to buy a simple baler without wrapping, uh, just for the straw. If you know how to disable wrapping on this uh, baler, then please let me know would be nice to use uh, just one baler uh, and not two for different purposes. And by the way, at this time it's not me doing the baling, it's the helper. I'm just sitting behind and watching just as you. Because I like to bail, but uh, the square bells. I hate to have to stop each time, uh, press the unload button and then start again, then stop again, then unload. It's a pain in the arse for me, so um, if I use this uh, round bales, I use the helper usually. You know, if you have waited uh, for a master plan uh, from me for this uh, season, I'll have to disappoint you because I don't have it. You know, I haven't decided what exactly I'm gonna do. Uh, Because this is not a staged gameplay. It's... uh, It's meant just to enjoy the game, to play it uh, as you like. Also because uh, it's quite extensive gameplay, it usually takes a couple of months for a full season, so uh, yeah, I don't have a plan. You just saw me <laughs> buying uh, one of the mods, in this case uh, it was I think a Fend, um, a Baylor, 
which I mentioned previously, and it didn't work. So it looked nice, quite detailed, but it didn't work. So uh, I didn't solve it, I just went and uh, deleted the mod and then re-added to my uh, account, bank account, uh, uh, the money that I paid. So that's how I uh, solved the problem. Now, this is also a mod, but it's a simple one because it's basically the in-game bailer, um, New Holland bailer in red. So it should work flawlessly in, in theory because there's not uh, much uh, modifications in it. And uh, as you can see, uh, half of the mold grass, um, I'm bailing it into silage. The other half, I'm bailing it into uh, grass. But again, I'll discover later that uh, feed mixers, the, the mobile ones, the implement ones, they do not accept uh, grass. They specifically require um, hay. Uh, I actually forgot about this because I was using for for so long these uh, placeable mixers which do not make uh, any difference among uh, hay or uh, grass so uh, basically I'll have to mow this field uh, once more and then make some uh, hay bales and for this of course we're gonna need uh, uh, some, uh, some rakes So now I'll set this baler to bail me some uh, straw, well not some, but all the straw. Because unlike grass that you use basically unlimited, straw is limited. You have to uh, seed barley or wheat, then you have to harvest it, so on. Uh, this time I'm using an updated version of this uh, road train mod and uh, as you can see it packs the round bales uh, vertically it used to do it horizontally uh, I don't know which one I prefer this one or as it used to be but it looks like uh, vertically uh, more bales uh, fit I haven't counted them. I think there's 32 in total. I don't know. You can pause the game and just count the bells. I'm just too lazy to do it right now. Yeah, these train rails sometimes will give me some problems. Either the tractors and the um, the truck will jump on them, either they'll just stop. So I decided to seed the rest of the field with grass, because there's no, no good, uh, no fun if uh, just half of it has grass. And of course we're gonna need a tail handler and this time I'm not gonna use if you if you remember I tried to use a New Holland tail handler previously but it wasn't handling as good as the built-in uh, the built-in tail handler 
this time I downloaded this class, which is basically a reskin version of the the in-game one, and it looks to to work uh, great. So I'm gonna use it. So I think there's 36 bales in one load, 9 by 2 by 2 if I'm not mistaken. I, I still haven't paused uh, the game to count it. I try to count it on, on, the, on the fly. And this tractor, I later looked in, uh, in its file and discovered that it's, get, it's actually getting dirty very, very fast. Like other vehicles will have these values at 300. This structure has it at 50, so uh, I'll later edit it to, to make it uh, less uh, prone to uh, getting dirty. As for the mixer, uh, of course the biggest, the largest mixer that I know of is the Pecan Biga, which we used for the last couple of seasons. Uh, temporarily, of course. Um, this time I decided to use uh, one from this Kuhn pack, which provides actually three um, uh, three uh, mixers. I think the biggest one is uh, that, I, that I bought is 42,000 uh, liters. I don't know how realistic is this. Um, well, considering the price, I guess it's probably realistic, I don't know. And you saw me trying to put some uh, uh, some grass bales in it, and it didn't work. So that's when I discovered. Well, I yes, I discovered that it doesn't accept uh, grass bales. So then I decided to just fast forward the the game for a couple of days until my grass will regrow, and then we're gonna remow the field and make um, uh, make hay. So by the time we'll make the hay, we'll have uh, a great uh, collection of, of bales on the ground. I was searching for another pallet factory to feed it uh, with these uh, timber boards and I couldn't find it and I decided uh, to continue to use just one uh, pellet factory um, but soon I'll um, I'll stop uh, doing forestry so basically I'll sell all my pellets and all the boards that I have and concentrate all my time and resources uh, to just farming I actually like a lot this tractor. This um, these uh, tracks, enlarged tracks, look very nice. The default uh, ones are too narrow. I'm constantly searching for uh, new mods, and new I mean for me, not in general. And again, most of them are just trash. So now it looks like we have a double load of pallets, which means that we can deliver them and take the money and run. Because we still need money to sponsor our animal activities. 
at some point um, those should provide us enough money to to upgrade our stuff but for now we're gonna sponsor them with this wood cutting and wood processing stuff yeah and it looks like the best uh, paying sell point is here on top of the map and again it's gonna be one of those that are not uh, that great to use I I like better the drive-through selling points not these ones where you have to back because you lose a lot of time to unload and then to rebuild your uh, multi-trailer configuration yeah so in order to extract those two grass bales from the mixer I found an easier solution just to reset the mixer and the bales uh, remained hanging in air so I had to go back to take the mixer from the respawning point which is uh, on this map is next to uh, the vehicle store on other maps it's actually uh, at your farm home farm yeah so as I'm gaining money I uh, I'm returning the the credit that I took earlier um, I'll try in this season not to loan at all from this point if possible or not to loan as much as I did previously because uh, basically no point we have this forestry business that's gonna supply us with money I still have installed that uh, loan mod which increases your uh, loan but it's a fair one because as your loan increases your mm, rate uh, also increases so it's I don't I don't think it's an overpowered mod so I think it's fair to use it And it works just like the in-game uh, loaning system unlike Bank of Hagelstadt if you probably know this uh, mod which is quite old now uh, it has a different system so uh, it has a more traditional type of returning the loan you're not only returning um, you're not only paying uh, your rate uh, each cycle which is a day in this game you also return a part of the credit and the rate is uh, a lot lot bigger with Bank of Hagelstadt now I'll discover I, a thing uh, I don't know probably it's a bug uh, probably it's the map probably it's this rake but it will leave some patches of uh, unraked um, grass for some reason I remember I had this uh, problem earlier uh, in other seasons and I still haven't figured out uh, which was the cause the game or uh, uh, the map or uh, the rake itself so I, at this point I started to sell out my uh, uh, timber boards I decided not to process uh, them into pallets because it, it's gonna take us too many days uh, yeah so I, I'll start selling them um, in order to make my life easier I went and extended the, the selling area uh, for the timber boards uh, so that I can dump, dump more of them on the selling point and this is where you can see 
that uh, one win row of grass remains as grass, it doesn't transform into hay. And this I don't like, I don't know what's the problem. And actually no, this is not the the cell point that I extended. It's actually another one. It's on the south of the map. I don't ask me the names, the name of the selling point because there are so many on this map that I don't have neither the time, neither the good enough memory to memorize all the names. Yes, and I decided not to mow all the field because now we need um, uh, just uh, hay bales. Uh, uh, we have uh, a good amount of uh, silage bales now, so there's no need to to make so many uh, hay bales. Yeah, since my tractors are busy, I went with my truck and brought home back a mixer. It's good that these mod trucks have this uh, trailer hitch. Again, I don't know how realistic is this. I don't know if, it, if you can really uh, attach some agricultural implements on, tra on trucks. And this now will finally be the last stage of making hay. One is mowing, the other is raking, then it's uh, bowing. And finally the fourth one, not, uh, not considering the seeding of the grass and fertilizer, for fertilizing. Oh, I actually, I actually forgot that uh, your grass is only fertilized just once. So uh, when I mowed it now the second time, I actually got uh, less grass, but it's not a problem, we can mow it later. So I just bought uh, an animal trailer, the same one uh, that I used previously, because it's the best one. And I just bought my first batch of uh, cows, 26 of them. So uh, now we can really start our uh, dairy business. But of course, before we can fast forward the game, I'll have to provide the cows with all they need. And most importantly, with water, because you can feed them as much as you like. If you don't give them water, they will not produce. And definitely now the density of bales is lower than it used, it used to be for the first time, because now the grass wasn't fertilized. Okay, so now I'll start this uh, process of making uh, uh, cow feed, mixing straw. Straw is actually not necessary, it's optional. Yeah. But I think I'll make a mistake and I'll dump too much uh, no, this time was okay. I think the, the next load I'll make a mistake and I'll have too much of one ingredient and I'll spoil all my uh, my feed. But for now the episode is almost over. As usual, thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed it then hit the like button and please come back next time for a new episode. I wish you all a great day and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.